<clears throat> hey, um, this is a really impromptu video. Um, I'm making this to hold myself accountable. And maybe that should just be what I call this video, holding myself accountable. Um, because basically today is the first day of my spring break. And, you know, when you're off of school, it's hard to prioritize and it's hard to remember everything that you want to accomplish. Um, although I guess the things I'm talking about in this video aren't really priorities. There are things I... They are things that I want to accomplish before the end of spring break. Um, I have the Christmas lights on. Hopefully it's not too distracting. If you think it's too distracting, shoot me a message in the comments and I won't have them on for any other video. But for now, for today, I'm going to just leave them on because I like them and I rarely turn them on and why not? Um, <clears throat> I had school today, but so I guess spring break technically starts tomorrow. So how many days is that? So 10 days, I think. Which is cool. Um, so 10 days, lots of things to do, but like two main categories, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. The first one is just finishing books. I have a multitude of books I want to finish because two of them specifically I've been reading for so long and I just want to get them out of the way. Um, those books, I'm sure you know by now, are Invisible Man by Ralph Ellison and Yoke by Mary H.K. Choi. I actually finished the third um, book in this, I guess, collection that I've had for like a couple months ago called Between the World and Me by Tanahisi Coates today, which is pretty cool. Um, I just, I listened to the audiobook. It's only like, um, I think, over, a little over, I think, three hours long on audiobook, but just, um, the way that it's written, there are only technically like three parts. There aren't really chapters. Yeah, I guess without the chapter separation, it's kind of hard to focus, at least for me. So it took me relatively a long time, but I'm finally finished with that, and I guess me finishing that book, <clears throat> even though it's taken me a while to read, motivates me to finish these as well. Um, I'm not even like at the beginning of either of them. On Yoke by Mary H. K. Choi, I'm on page 142 out of um, 401. <clears throat> and then Invisible Man, I am on page 109 out of um, five, <laughs> not 70. 581. Wow. Like, these books are, I mean, these pages are so thin, I always forget, but, yeah, because I'm, it looks like I'm, it looks like I haven't read that much. I mean, I haven't. This is, but I've read, as I just said, up to page 109, and it, but it doesn't look like that much of the book that I've read, which I haven't, but still, like, 109 is still a lot of pages, I feel like, but, um, yeah, I hope I'd say, okay, I may have to change my goal thinking about it. I'm definitely gonna, I want to finish Yoke. What page am I on again? Can't remember, haha. -ha. 142, so if I round that to 150, 150 divided by um, 400 is what? 75 divided by 200. Um, 15 divided by 40. 5 divided by 8. Five eighths through, maybe. That's definitely not true because <laughs> half of four hundred is two hundred, and I'm not at page two hundred. Math is not my strong suit, but yeah, <clears throat> I think I can definitely finish this. Short chapters and way less daunting than the five hundred plus page book. So I'm changing it. I'm definitely finishing this. Hopefully, finishing Invisible Man. The other books that I'm reading, I don't have um, physical copies of. It's actually only one book, um, which is How to Be Perfect, which is written by the creator of The Good Place, and it's a book all about philosophy. I'm listening to the audiobook of that, and it's also narrated by lots of different um, actors from The Good Place, including Jamila Jamil, Manny Jacinto, William Jackson Harper, Kristen Bell, Mark Evan Jackson, and I think actually a philosopher or like a professor or something called named Tom Ma Todd May as well. And I think I'm around 20% done with that book. Another book that I actually want to read, which I actually haven't started yet, from this point is The Crossover by Kwame Alexander. And that is because the, um, not Netflix, the Disney Plus adaptation actually came out two days ago, which is so cool. I want to read it and react to the TV show as soon as possible to get, um in front of the game in terms of, like, making a video for it. And also I just like watching shows when they first come out, so, um... Yeah, I hope to read that tonight and make and at least start this the show slash series tonight as well. Um, so that'll be cool. It's in verse, so it's not like that. Um, 
hard, or like it doesn't take that much time to read, I guess. So I, th I think it's a, it's a good goal and an easy goal enough, easy enough goal because I feel like I, I usually read books in verse in like one day, so I'll be fine. Um, I also got this book from the library. American Born Chinese. There is a Disney Plus adaptation coming out for this one as well, but I just searched it up and apparently it's coming out on May 24th. For some reason I thought it was coming out sometime in April, so... <laughs> I may I just I may just return this because like, I'm not going to read it that ahead of schedule of the TV show because I'm just going to forget about what happened to the book. Um, however, something I just thought about, there is another TV show coming out in April. Um, called Sweet Tooth, and the second season is coming out. So maybe I should... I don't know if I want to make a video on that, because I don't really want to read the comic book. I have read a little bit of the first comic book or graphic novel of it, and I didn't really like it, so I'm not that motivated to read the book. But it is still an adaptation, and, like, I watched the first season of the show, and I really liked it, so maybe I will... Maybe I'll make a video about that. Yeah, that's coming out sometime in April. <coughs> So yes, those are the books that I want to read. I think those are it. Um, and I guess the reason why I want to read them is first because obviously I have the time because I'm out of school, but also because uh, there's so many books here. Some that you can see like in the corner of the shot here, and then um, those books are on top of a tower of more books that are like in an actual compartment um, as well. I have a, I have a um, box of books under my bed as well. So lots and lots of books that I haven't read. Also, <laughs> the whole entire room, I think this room right here, are full of books I haven't read either. So lots of books to read and I guess I've been feeling a little sad looking at all the books and realizing I haven't read any of them. And yeah. I gotta get to it, and that means reading books that I'm currently reading so I can make room for new books. So, yeah, I think those are all the books I want to read. Going into, the, I guess, the next broad section of things I want to do. <clears throat> These are all, I guess, kind of related to the channel. Oh, I forgot in one, actually. I want to read and finish a book called The Great Gatsby by F. Scott J Fitzgerald. You've probably heard of it. Um, we're actually reading it in school, so that's why. And I have to read it before the end of spring break, so... Yes, um, I also need to do that. I'm not sure I felt I'm not gonna make a video specifically for that book, but it'll probably be in a, be in a wrap up or something like that. So, yeah, that is another book that I need to read. I just remembered that. Now, going on to the second category, and this is solely related to the channel, and that is editing videos. I've actually, um, for the past two weeks, I guess, been filming. A lot of videos, I don't want to tell you every single video idea that I have, but yeah, there are multiple videos that I have yet to edit, that I want to edit, and put out for you all as well. You know what, I will tell you, because I feel like <laughs> we want to make these sections proportional, kind of at least. I can't only be talking about the videos I want to edit for like two minutes, and the other section of the video is so long, um, so... I'll tell you the ones that I guess you can maybe assume, you may be able to assume, I guess, which are um, some episode episode reactions to Daisy Jones the Six. Yeah, I haven't uploaded for episodes um, 5 to 10 at this point, and I have filmed all of them, so in episode 4, when I'm filming this, episode 4 reaction, I think it's coming out next Monday, and I have edited that one. Um, but yeah, gotta get on top of those. The first half of the album I reacted to, and that video is coming out tomorrow on Friday. Um, and I gotta edit the second part, which follows or which um, documents my reaction to episode or sorry songs. I guess it would be six to eleven, yeah. From the album Aurora, so I want to do that, and also other videos that. I don't want to just talk about. So yeah, those are all my plans. I told you this was impromptu, not really that formed, I guess. Just wanted to sit down, talk about it, talk with somebody about what I want to accomplish, because I've heard that talking is important, <laughs> and planning things are important. <laughs> so yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for indulging, because I feel like this is this was kind of a boring video.